Okay, by this title, as you may have seen, I can't believe I'm about to make this video. This is, I never thought that I would be the one to buy a Nem um, Demir Ben print bag. But this bag has grown on me um, and I love pink. So I just decided to sell my never full GM in monogram and buy this one instead because I did write, read on Instagram someone had posted that this was the last month to buy this bag because they are I think they are stop um, doing it selling it making it whatever um, so that that was my you know let's get let's get on it let's buy it let's buy it let's sell my bag so I did and um, I have the box here I just picked it up from my post office so I want to see it <clears throat> here's the bag I just opened the seal and um, tissue paper okay this is kind of exciting this is the first time it's upside down but uh, okay let's turn it around the first time I get a Louis Vuitton sticker and tissue when I order from the store so the receipt holder Louis Vuitton or burnt orange my receipt and it the bag is 9000 sweet 300 Swedish crowns and the postage is 180 Swedish crowns. So the total was 4, 000, sorry, 9,480 Swedish crowns. And um, they have had a price increase on this bag. Nothing too bad. 200 Swedish crowns since um, the beginning of this year. Now to open, let's see if I can carefully open this seal. I want to keep this sticker. And there's the box. And here's the bag. Let's just hope that this time the box actually goes in the bag because with my key pole, the box was way too wide to fit in the bag. Um, kind of disappointing. So that is just tissue paper left. Uh, I was kind of worried that I would get, i seen other unboxings and their boxes have been, you know, like this tall or something. Um, but I'm really, this is a good size box. It will fit in my closet. No, I have to untie the ribbon. No, maybe not. I really don't like untying the ribbons because I'm not that skilled to... Uh, tie it back. So, Louis Vuitton box, magnetic. Here it is. 
Dust bag and bag out, box away. Dust bag, new dust bag lights with the navy writing. To reveal. My Neverfull MM and the Damier Eben with the rose battery. That is so gorgeous. I just need to take a second. That is so beautiful. I mean, look at that pink. But it is kind of darker um, than it shows. I mean, I always thought it would be like really light. I, I can see it's not this light. I mean, it's kind of darker. But it's so pretty. It's so pretty. Okay, here's something else that is weird. I mean, I never thought that the GM size was humongous, like everyone else put it. Put, but this kind of looks really small now. I mean, look at it. Otherwise, it is bigger, and I just used to that size, and now with this size, it looks small. I mean, this is some getting used to. Not that I, I don't like it. The re uh, That was one of the reasons why I did decide to buy this bag. Um, it's mainly because I was, you know, looking at my bag and, you know, going like, okay, I have one year le left um, in my studies, college. Um, and uh, the, the the main reason why I chose the Neverfull GM was um, you may have seen my what's in my bag uh, work edition Neverfull uh, video on my channel. Otherwise, check it out. Um, that was the main reason why I won the, the GM size because I bring a lot of stuff to work. Um, but then when I um, when I'm about to soon be finished with my school and not going to work there anymore in the clothing store um, and this coming out and this about to not be sold anymore um, I just thought okay maybe I should buy the MM size because it is a great size and it doesn't look that big and I don't carry <laughs> I mean I never feel my never fold on a daily basis so that's why I chose this bag and I'm so happy and I, I, I have to show you the pouch. This has, um, I did sell my other pouch. It was just because I have the pochette and I didn't think if I have the pochette I don't need a pouch. But. Um, recently I've been thinking about repurchasing it, the pouch, but then I hold it off because uh, if I was going to buy this bag, so now I have the pouch. Beautiful. And um, I'm going to use this. Uh, when I start when my school ends and I start as a teacher in school because this print isn't that flashy and if you don't know Louis Vuitton you may people may not oh my god she has Louis Vuitton that sort of thing not that I care <clears throat> and um, also I did see um, I did see on Instagram someone who had gotten her bag um, 
Sorry, distracted by my cat. He went in the box. You know, cat love their boxes. Um, other, either way, she had uh, gone to a cobbler and they had put this attachment on that side too so she could wear it with a strap and I'm thinking about doing that too. So, um, anything else? Let's see if I can find the material card. Maybe in the pocket. Yes, here it is. Coated fabric. Let's see if it will focus. Oh, these stupid cameras are never focusing. Okay, coated fabric, cow hard leather trim, man-made li man lining. And here is the skew number. The number is N416003. And it's a Neverfull MM new model. Damir Ben Rose Ballerine. And I also just wanted to say that I have seen a lot of unboxings and those people have said that they are worried about the pink lining. But uh, if you are careful, I mean I am careful with my bags. I mean I don't baby baby it but I am aware of it. Um, you won't get any spots and I mean the, the beige interior I had on my, my GM um, it didn't get any spots and I had it for a year so just be careful and I also bought an um, organizer when I do uh, what's in my bag I will include my organizer so you can see it and where I bought it from and which color and size and all that stuff all that good stuff but if you don't um i think it will be delivered end of this week um but otherwise it's from the original club a shop on etsy and it's a good price and i think i had a coupon xmas you know x or send mass uh 2016 and you will get 15 percent off but anything else maybe some kind of mod shots Okay, the strap drop isn't, you know, really high, um, but it will do. Oh my god, I'm so happy. Okay, um, this is this video, kind of long for an unboxing, I'm so sorry. But I just wanted to tell my story, um, you know why I said my why I saw my never uh, GM size why about the MM size and um, some people may find that really helpful uh, trying to decide whether to buy either one or if they are thinking like me and they want oh they love this bag but they don't have the funds to to buy it and um, you know have to never falls um, but either way um thank you so much for watching and thank you to all my subscribers i don't i know i don't say that uh, as often as i should and w want to but thank you so much i really hope you enjoyed this video i mean i'm over the moon i <laughs> i love pink <laughs> but watch out for my unbox um not unboxing my what's in my bag kind of video and I will see you in my next video. Bye!